All kinds of basics, from food to medicine and even sanitary napkins, are becoming increasingly out of reach for Venezuelans because of rampant hyperinflation. Sanitary napkins can be bought on the black market, but are unaffordable for many women. So for now, they do what they can. We use an old sheet and cotton. I cut it into pieces, and I also use a plastic bag. Desiree lives in a house full of women who do the same thing during their period. I use a plastic bag and pieces of fabric. Raquel Perez, a mother of three, says she has not used a store-bought sanitary napkin in two years. It is very expensive and I can't afford it. We don't make enough money. If we buy sanitary napkins, we don't have money to buy diapers. I prefer buying diapers. Human rights advocate Luisa Kislinger says this shortage is not only unsanitary, but it keeps women from living a normal life during their period. That prevents many women, girls and adolescents during those days to take part in their daily activities, like going to school or work. It's not just health products, the prices of everything from food to gasoline rose 33 percent in July alone, and for most Venezuelans, living without has become a way of life. For Adriana Núñez Rabascal in Caracas, Cristina Caicedo-Smith, VOA News.